So whilst other people are liable to things like, for instance, these floods that have been ruining people's goods, if you have a high inventory turnover ratio, you're less likely to lose your goods because most of your goods are already in cash anyways. And you Hello, today we speak about our inventory turnover ratio. The inventory turnover ratio tells us how many times we sell or replace our goods over a certain period of time. So let's say you, over a period of time, let's say one month, sold 5,000 worth of goods. Yet you have to calculate the average amount of goods that you have in your shop at every point in time. So say at every point in time, you had 1,000 series worth of goods in your shop. That would mean your inventory turnover ratio is 5,000 Ghana cities over 1000 Ghana cities in 25. It means within a period of one month you were able to restock five times which looking at you know all aspects of business it's a good ratio. So why would you want your inventory turnover ratio to be high? There are benefits to having a high inventory turnover ratio. If your ratio is five over one year it's a totally different story than if it's five over one month. For one low storage cost I mean that's a no-brainer. You have less goods in your shop and you sell them very quickly. You don't spend a lot on rent and storage space. It also means you're doing quick sales so you're very liquid everybody likes you know quick cash quick business it also means that you have a very fast cash conversion rate you're able to convert your goods to cash very very quickly and there's nothing better than cash to be frank so whilst other people are liable to things like for instance these floods that have been ruining people's goods if you have a high inventory turnover ratio you're less likely to lose your goods because most of your goods are already in cash anyways and you are holding a small amount of stock risking less to damage and force majority and when more people buy your goods you start to notice the trends you know who buys what which moves fast which moves slow which will have you make better decisions so try to know your inventory turnover ratio uh, as a high inventory turnover ratio will allow you to enjoy all the benefits that i've just mentioned as opposed to having a low inventory turnover ratio to which you would like to hold maybe a less amount of stock within that amount of time and replenish much quicker than you normally would in order to release capital for other stuff that's all for today well brought to you by Africa School of Entrepreneurship and supported by GCB Bank, your bank for life.